Yo guys, what is going on? Sizes here. Welcome back to another video. Today, we're going to be carbonating clickbait right here. This is the brand new flavor, clickbait. It is a cherry pomegranate flavor. If you guys haven't already, make sure to go check out my official review for that. I will link it down below in the description at the very top. And then also, I think before we carbonate it, we're going to be comparing this flavor to a mix of cherry limeade and phaseberry because in my honest opinion, I think that it's very very similar to uh, cherry limeade and phaseberry. So that's what we're gonna be doing. We're first going to make clickbait and then we're gonna be doing a mix of phaseberry and cherry limeade in a different shaker cup. I think it's it's close to a 25% phaseberry, 75% cherry limeade. So that is what we're going to do. Right here, we have our other cup that we're gonna be doing this with. So again, 75% cherry limeade, 25% of um phase berry so i think that that is what this proper mix would be so that is what we are going to try we have about about 75 percent right there of cherry limeade now we're going to do a 25 percent of phase berry and see how close it is again they say that clickbait is a brand new flavor but how true is that i mean i feel like that after a while, after a certain point, a lot of flavors are going to start to see, taste similar due to their flavor profiles. Again, it's a cherry pomegranate and phaseberry has pomegranate in it. And uh, cherry limeade is obviously has uh, cherry in it. So because of that, because of those factors involved, I think it's going to be very, very close. And even by the look of the color of the flavor, uh, they look very, very similar right there. Uh, very, very close in color for both the mix of cherry limeade and phaseberry, and then also just clickbait in general. Let's go ahead and give clickbait a smell. Again, in my mind, it smells very, very similar to cherry limeade. So I'm thinking that it's gonna taste a lot like this. Let's go ahead and smell the phaseberry cherry limeade mix. And again, it smells very, very similar. They both smell very, very similar. Um, I smell a little bit of the lime though from the cherry limeade within the mix flavor. Let's go ahead, give them a try, taste them side by side. Again, you get that initial pomegranate and then that cherry aftertaste. Let's go ahead and try it then with phaseberry and cherry limeade. And you know, as much as I want to say that they are similar, they do have some differences. I think that the the phaseberry phaseberry flavor in general is very very fruity. So because of that, it's not going to be the same as clickbait, which of course is just a cherry pomegranate or pomegranate cherry, uh, whichever one you want to say. But because of that, again, I think that clickbait is a lot more tart compared to uh, the phaseberry mix. And, and yeah, the phaseberry mix is just, it's super, super, uh, sweet. It's a very fruity flavor. Very, very sweet compared to the, um, compared to the just clickbait flavor. Clickbait is just a very, very tart flavor. We just went ahead and carbonated clickbait right here next to me. I have my soda stream right here. You, of course, if you guys have never seen any of my soda stream videos, you guys have to make sure if you are doing it, I have the Soda Stream One Touch. Uh, you have to make sure that you do the second option on the uh, Soda Stream, otherwise it will froth up way too much. And then again, you're going to see the carbonation release from the flavor, and you have to wait for that to fully release. Um, so then it is um, completely safe to take out of the system before it. Um, it otherwise, it would like explode. It would pretty much explode by you adding the air into it. Um, again, I have to wait a little bit. This seems to be a pretty frothy flavor. Some flavors are more frothy than others. This one in particular seems to be very, very frothy. So I have to wait a little bit longer before I can go ahead and take the bottle out of the machine. It still might even overflow. I'm not too sure. But again, we just have to wait and see. But like I said, you have to do the second option with the soda stream if you guys are carbonating your G fuels. Um, and of course, this is with the one touch. You can't, I'm not too sure how it is with the other one where it's the button on top and you just have to keep pressing that to carbonate the drink. 
I'm not too sure how long you have to do that for or anything like that. This seems to be taking quite, quite a while to uh, to let the carbonation, let the, the frothiness settle, but I think it is almost ready. I should probably be able to take it out about now. So let's go ahead and do that. There we go. You see it frothed up a little bit at the top. Let's go ahead and pour in our clickbait, our carbonated clickbait right there. Looks great. It actually does look really, really good. And rumor has it when cherry pomegranate was first created, it was actually supposed to have a canned flavor along with it. I'm not too sure what happened there. Um, I also want to give a huge shout out to Bob Gino for recommending doing the phase berry and cherry limeade mix. And then also another huge shout out to Harry. He's one of my moderators in both my discord and my YouTube streams. He's the one that created the thumbnail, the, uh, the little clickbait can on the thumbnail. So shout out to you two. Here we go. This is clickbait carbonated. Let's go. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. That's really good. That's a really good flavor. It's, um, I think the carbonation makes the cherry stand out more instead of it just being more of like an aftertaste. It definitely helps the cherry come out more in the beginning rather than in the end of the drink. And that is, that is superb. I think I honestly like clickbait carbonated better than I like it in just the, just the regular form in the shaker cup. I think carbonated is definitely the way to go. Like I said, though, we were supposed to have cherry pomegranate cans when this flavor first came out. We might see them later down the line. A clickbait can, like I said, would be really, really cool, especially if it's the same design that Harry made for me for the thumbnail. I think it would look awesome. I think it would be great. Um, but that is it. That is it for the video. Let me know your thoughts. Uh, would you try carbonated clickbait? Uh, and, and what do you think? Do you think that it is just a reskin of, or or just a mix, I should say, of phase berry and cherry limeade? Let me know all your thoughts down below in the comments or join my Discord, which is always on the top of the description. But hope you guys enjoy the video, and I'll see you all in the next one.